Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if a JavaScript error has occurred in the main process on your Windows computer. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and just jump straight into it. So what we are going to start off this tutorial with is opening up the control panel. So just left click on the start button one time. Type in control panel. Best result should go back with control panel listed right above app. So go ahead and left click on that. Select the view by option and select large icons. Then select programs and features. And now under any programs and features you want to go select discord and select the uninstall button. So you are going to have to uninstall discord here. And we're going to be reinstalling it so don't worry it won't be going too long. And once it's out of the programs and features list here, you might have to just give it a moment here. Once it's gone, close out of here. Open up the star menu. Type in percent sign app data percent sign. Best man should go back with percent sign app data percent sign file folder. Go ahead and left click on that. Now that we are in here, you want to go ahead and locate the Discord folder. And you want to right click on it and select delete. You might have to give it a moment to fully delete the files there. And then once it's done you can close out of here. Now we're going to type in to the start menu percent sign local app data percent sign. Another file folder should appear. Go ahead and left click on that. And now again there should be a discord folder in here. Right click on it and select delete might take a moment to delete. Once you're done with that, close it there. And then we're going to go back to the start menu again. Type in services. Best results should go back with services listed right above app. So go ahead and left click on that. Now you want to go ahead and locate the service that says quality windows audio video experience. So scroll down to the queues there. So start to the queue. So quality windows audio video experience double click on that and now you want to go set startup type to automatic and if service status is stopped you want to select the start button and once you're done with that select apply and OK close out of here you will need to restart your computer and once your computer has restarted you can go down with discord again so let's just go ahead and restart our computer here just so we show the full tutorial Okay, so once you've restarted, we're going to open up a web browser here. It doesn't matter which one, we're going to open up Google Chrome. Uh, you can open up whatever you want. And into Google, you want to go just search up Discord and just search for that. And one of the best managers should be for Discord domain. Select the Downloads button on this page. So you can go on Discord and then navigate to their download section, or you can just go ahead and do that shortcut that I just showed. Select the Download for Windows button. We'll take a couple minutes or a couple seconds to download, depending on your internet speed. It should be pretty quick here in our case.
And once it's done downloading, just go ahead and open it up. We're going to go and select Run. Okay, there you go guys, sign back in and that should pretty much be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.